Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Sean from Double Clutch HD, and I am coming at you with another Road to Glory episode with Lightning McQueen. And I know I've been neglecting this series a little, but I'm back to posting this series. I uh, couldn't really play this as I was playing a lot of NBA 2K, and editing those videos takes a long time, guys. Takes a long time. So, um, yeah, I've been focusing on NBA, but now I'm bringing back this Road to Glory series as NBA is kind of dying down, and I'm waiting for next gen, just trying to uh, pump out these Road to Glory videos, and, uh, yeah, trying to see what I can do with Lightning McQueen, the speedster uh, for the Bruins, and uh, k k Kitty, what are you doing? You're like, oh, okay, you're, you, you, okay, my cat was, like, interrupting my commentary. Lo siento, senors and senoritas. But anyway, let's get into the game. So now I'm, I bumped the quarters down to 8 minutes. Uh, ne that Nebraska game, I bumped to 10 minutes because it was 10 or 12 minutes. 12 minute quarters because uh, I want to get more playing time. But now that I'm the second string, I'm probably going to get a, a lot more playing time. And ooh, uh, Brett Hundley almost gets picked off right there. So Lightning McQueen going on a little slant. Brett Hundley tried to scramble. It's a fumble! And the lineman for New Mexico State. Oh, he, he tripped over himself. Oh. He could have taken that to the house, man. What are you doing? But anyway, New Mexico State sc still scores a touchdown. So UCLA needs to bounce back. The momentum not shifting in their favor to start. That was a big hit by the linebacker. But Lightning McQueen, he hangs on. So fourth and inches. Let's see what the Bruins can do. UCLA, UCLA, fight, fight, fight. Oh no, we're only gonna take that for 11 yards. But Lightning McQueen right there, he's he's been a beast so far. And as a second string, he's been doing very well for the Bruins as he picks up 12 yards on the read option. Brett Hundley recognized the defense was going for him, so he just handed it off to Lightning and he did the rest. So let's see the replay right here. Great blocking up front by the Bruins. Uh, the, the competition is definitely going to get tougher as we uh, progress to the ear. But New Mexico State, their defensive line is not very good. So, oh, look at him. He just trucked. Lightning McQueen, the speed running back, just trucked over someone. That just proves that New Mexico State sucks. So we tie the game up at 7. Start off the second quarter. Lightning McQueen, ooh, dodging and weaving. He's going to get to about the eh, 438. And it's going to be third and inches. As they stopped in right before, and uh, I think they turned it over or something, because Lightning McQueen is on another screen play, and he's not going to pick up enough for the first, not by a long shot. And four minutes left in the second quarter, Lightning McQueen makes the catch, but only a two-yard reception, and he has three receptions for 18 yards so far. So let's see what uh, what UCLA can do. Another halfback draw. Uh, it's kind of broken in this game because it takes so long to develop. But Lightning McQueen manages to pick up 8 yards right there. 7 rushes for 40 yards. And he's been a beast so far. Checking out the replay. he That was great blocking by the lineman right there. He just, yeah, he just kind of bowled over the guy. But uh, 2.35 left in the second quarter. Lightning McQueen running it again. 5-yard rush. UCLA trying to make a final push for a touchdown, but they can't get it. Ooh, nice punt by the punter right here. Lightning McQueen has a lot of daylight. Let's see what he can do. And he, ooh, he makes two people miss, but he goes down at about the 46-yard line. So third and eight. UCLA needs a first down right here. And Lightning McQueen on a little screen has a lot of daylight, but somehow the cornerback, uh, the cornerbacks managed to track him down. And UCLA can't get any points off of that, unfortunately. So third and three. Lightning McQueen he jukes a little, and he's gonna get a first down right there. Picked up about six, and now second and four, 437 left in the third quarter. Lightning McQueen blocking for Brett Hundley. No, there is no need for blocking because Brett Hundley just decides to take off, and he goes down the sideline, and he picks up about 30 or 40 yards. So it's first and 10. Lightning McQueen, ooh, he jukes it outside. Has a lot of daylight down the sideline. Not enough speed to break the tackles or uh, avoid them, actually. I don't, know what, I don't know what I just said. But UCLA, they're going to pick up the first down. And Lightning McQueen, that was like a 20-yard rush right there. And uh, New Mexico just a little too slow to catch up to him as he turned the corner. Now third and four, Lightning McQueen on another halfback screen. You would think 
that New Mexico State will learn from their mistakes, and I guess they kind of did, except the screenplays are glitched in this game. So first and goal, UCLA up 14 to seven in the third quarter, and Lightning McQueen makes a couple juke moves, make a couple make a couple people miss, and he gets into the touchdown. Right there, he steps over a <laughs> New Mexico State defender, but that's okay. And he gets into the touchdown, so 21 to seven, extending their lead to 14. And 21 seconds left. Lightning McQueen just trying to run out this clock and get out of here with a win. And they're gonna—he's gonna not gonna pick up that first down, I don't think. And second and eight. Lightning McQueen just said, "Screw it, I'm just running straight. <laughs> no need for a screen. Just, just run straight." And now Lightning McQueen, third and ten. UCLA up 24 to seven. And it looks like they're on the home stretch right here. And Lightning McQueen makes the catch, but not enough yards to pick up the first. As a corner, as a linebacker made a nice tackle. As Lightning McQueen made the nice catch on the nice route he ran, but the linebacker was just a little faster than Lightning McQueen would have liked. So first and 10, 250 left in the fourth quarter. And Lightning McQueen has some daylight. Ah, oh, receiver, you should have held that block for a couple more seconds. We would have been home free. But the receiver, he decided to move on and try to block another person. But that's all right. That's Lightning McQueen picked up about 40 yards. See if he had held, see if he, if he had held that block. Uh, Lightning McQueen would have been pretty, would have a lot of space to work with, to say the least. Now, read option. Lightning McQueen avoids the defender, gets into the end zone. Two touchdowns on the day for the speedster himself. And with 123 left, it looks like UCLA is going to win this game. New Mexico State, no timeouts. Uh, their offense has struggled all day. And it doesn't look like they're going to make a comeback here. So, UCLA, uh, they're going to win at the Rose Bowl. And they're going to. They're going to improve the 2-0 and on the season, I believe. And and there's a final kneel by Brett Hundley, and UCLA wins. So it was a pretty, it was a good game for Lightning McQueen. Didn't get enough carries to actually make a huge impact on the game. But he did score two touchdowns and had a, had a couple receptions. Look at the play of the game right here. He That was a nice cut right there to avoid the defender. Probably could have trucked over him, but he, he took the safe route. And just walked into the end zone. So UCLA, he uh, Lightning McQueen, look at his day. 106 yards rushing, breaks the century mark. Nine receptions for 37 yards. And UCLA is going to win. So here's an attribute boost just before you, uh, Lightning McQueen gets into another position battle. Against the injured Jones, he's going to start anyway. But it's good to have that first seed locked up. And so... Uh, Lightning McQueen now, he's going to take a dr handoff right here, get the fir uh, first down. There ain't no first downs in practice. What am I thinking? But, yeah, Lightning McQueen, it's pretty clear that he'll win this position battle, especially after this run. And, yeah. So, it was a pretty good game for Lightning McQueen and UCLA overall. And looks like they'll be Lightning McQueen will be UCLA's starting court, uh, running back next week so stay tuned guys for episode number nine coming out soon and i will i will definitely post more of these if you guys enjoy please leave a comment like rate subscribe do all that good stuff and have a great day guys and thanks for watching